My name is Philip Nazario. I'm a senior network engineer with the NISO. I've been employed with the NISO for about three years. October makes three years and it has been a great experience. I was born and raised in Bronx, New York. And as a child, I figured out I like to tinker with electronics. Uh, I'm 39 years old, so when I was a young child, computers weren't as available. Um, but I remember when a television or a VCR would break in my household, I would you know, tell my parents, don't throw it out yet. And I would like try to take it apart and tinker with it, figure out how it works, see if I could make it work again. Eventually I was exposed to computers, which led me down the path that I'm in now with my career. Um, you know, initially I started just playing computer games in, in first grade. I remember playing, going to the computer lab in school and playing Oregon Trail. Um, as I got older and computers became more accessible, I've learned different things, applications and games and different uses for computers. When I graduated, I started out as a network technician at Albany Medical Center. That's where I began my career. And I stood there for about nine years and moved my way up through the ranks into a senior network engineer. For me, it's not, uh, uh, employment's not just about making a, a good living, uh, about money, but it's also I wanted to be somewhere where I could be happy and that I felt I, I could make a difference. And so I did some research on the NISO because initially I did not know, I had never even heard of the NISO, to be honest. And I did some research and um, the mission statement for the NISO is what kind of intrigued me, you know, of re reliably managing New York's power grid along with its energy markets. And um, that's when I kind of knew I wanted to apply and was hoping I would get the position. The energy power infrastructure in America is extremely important. There are times where we run into high pressure situations. But when I think about the mission statement and keeping the grid available, the power grid available, it, it, the pressure kind of melts away. And I love technology, so I feel like I could tackle these issues. and. Um, and try to uh, just deflect the pressure. It, it doesn't really bother me too much. It's, uh, I know I'm contributing to something that helps a lot of people. Uh, you know, if you've ever been home and lost power during the winter, you know it's not a fun thing being in the dark and being cold. So uh, uh, as long as I feel I'm contributing and helping keep people happy, it makes me happy.